wasn't expecting what we pulled up on. We got here about 12.45 and it was devastated. A family owned business in Owens Crossroads picking up the pieces today after being in the direct path of a severe thunderstorm last night. And that's how we begin News 19 at 4. I'm Jerry Hayes. And I'm Christine Killemeyer. Just before midnight, a severe storm rolled through parts of Madison, Marshall, and Jackson counties, causing damage. The National Weather Service does not believe there was a tornado, but the damage is evident. Yeah, News 19's Emily Mosner joins us now live from SNS Service Center with the very latest. Emily? Good evening, guys. Well, as you mentioned, this family owned business is devastated today. If you look here behind me, you can see the walls have just completely caved in. You can see the insulation, even some of the pipes in the electrical unit, just all the way on its side. Now we're going to show you some News 19 drone video to give you a closer look of what this looks like from above. Now, as you can see, there is metal and materials from the roof that are just strewn about in the field next nearby. And this is a family owned auto repair shop. As we mentioned, they only have a few mechanics and the owner Jerry Sneed says he got a call from his brother in law shortly after the storm rolled through. However, he didn't expect this level of damage when he arrived. We got here about 1245 and it was devastated. It, it's, we've put our life into this for 20 years close to it and uh, you pull up and say half of your building gone and wonder what you're going to do. Now you can just hear the emotion and what he had to say there. Now Sneed says the next step is to just start cleaning up. While there is a lot of cleaning up to do, he is in good hands. As we've been out here today, the parking lot has just been full with people coming to support them as they're getting back to work. Now, as we've been driving around today, this is definitely some of the most damage that we have seen. You've also seen debris just scattered about in the road. And we also spoke to a couple of homeowners. Now both of them woke up to find very large trees in their yard, just narrow missing hitting their homes. Now you'll hear more from them coming up on News 19 at 5. But for now, live in Owens Crossroads, Emily Mosner, News 19.